Today we're traveling back to Fukushima, to an area near our previous video on Sabakoyu Public Bath. This place is known as Nakano Fudo-son. It is a Buddhist shrine to the god Akala. What makes this place an interesting destination is the beautiful scenery as well as the architecture. There is even a waterfall next to the shrine. Nakano Fudo-son was constructed back in 1180 and has remained open through the years. Unfortunately, while filming, our sound equipment was affected by the waterfall, as well as some other problems. So please bear with us. The god Akala, or Fudo in Japanese, is the god of wisdom as well as the indomitable spirit. Fudo in Japanese means immovable. This deity pops up all over the place in temples all across Japan. One of the main reasons being is that Akala is seen as a guide for the deceased for the first seven days after death to help them become Buddhas. He is also the protector of nature, which is why you usually find his temples deep in the mountains. Akala was brought from India, from India to China, and then from China to Japan. The main part of the shrine is on the second tier, but on the first tier you can see an entryway. Near the main entrance to the tunnel, there is a stand where you can buy candles before starting your journey. The candles cost 50 yen each, with a small drop box for your coins. Next, walk over to a large drop box and deposit some more coins. Light the candle using the small lantern after the drop box, and place the candle on the holder. Next, you are ready to go through the tunnel. There are a series of dark tunnels to walk through. The purpose of the dark tunnels is to teach a person about Buddhism. When you start your journey to enlightenment, you're in the dark, blindly searching for the truth. There are many different people, and in this case, gods, that guide you to enlightenment. Each god shines light on a part of enlightenment as you travel through the tunnel. The end of the tunnel is bright, signifying one reaching nirvana, or a perfect sense of enlightenment. As you travel through the tunnels, you will notice that there is not only one entrance and one exit. This is intentional and signifies the fact that a journey to enlightenment can begin anywhere, and one's personal journey to reach enlightenment may be completely different, as well as longer or shorter than another's journey. Getting to Nakano Fudo-son is very straightforward. However, when going on foot, it's a 45-minute walk one way from the nearest train station. To get to Nakano Fudo-son from the west entrance of the Fukushima City Station, go out the main exit and follow the green line. Which will turn blue all the way to the Fukushima Kotsu line. Get your ticket for 350 yen. If you are on the local train from Sendai, you are probably at the east entrance. You can turn and walk all the way to the Fukushima Kotsu line. If you accidentally go through the east gate, walk around the station and follow along the side until you come to an opening leading to the Fukushima Kotsu line. Now, the Fukushima Kotsu line is a city service and is not affiliated with JR, so JR passes won't work on it. Once you're on the train, follow it all the way to Hanami Zuzaka Station and get off. From the station entrance, follow Highway 313 to Highway 13. 
You won't be on Highway 13 long as there's an immediate left turn down a narrow road. Follow this long road all the way to a T and turn left. This road will take you all the way to the main entrance of Nakano Fudo-son. Nakano Fudo-son is definitely an adventure I would recommend for those who like to go for a good walk. The natural beauty surrounding it is breathtaking. Hi there. Did you like the video? Leave us a comment and tell us what you think. Like and subscribe if you'd like to get more updates. If you want to get involved and help us get to more cool locations in Tohoku, support us on Patreon. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Any information you need, we'll leave in the description below. Thank you. <laughs>